Alright guys, James from Stalls here and today I wanted to make a video on how to fix broken mp4 files, recordings, renders, you know, whatever it is, you may be able to fix it. Um, if it's like this on my main monitor, let me show you. Like this. So, that was my PC. Um, so you have like a file like, like this, where it, if you click it, it doesn't open with VLC etc. And you manage to get it to a fixed version, same size and everything. Basically, it's to do with um, this thing called a move atom that doesn't get put on the end of the file until it's finished recording, and and it's been like terminated. And if it glitches or it corrupts, or your power goes out, or you know your battery runs out on your drone or um, video camera, then it won't save that atom on the end. And that contains all the information to piece together the video when you play it. Um, so basically, there's a way to get that back, and I'm going to show you that in this video. So th this is what I was doing. I was trying to render this um, six-hour, thirty-four-long XQC rod, and literally, when he gets to this helicopter here, this like fast movement for some reason, the motion blur and stuff on his game. Um, made my CPU overheat like for some reason Adobe Media Encoder it's been using a lot of my CPU more than anything it literally is like a radiator in my room and I don't know why it's just using so much CPU and it came up with this error I've tried fixing the fan curves and it does help it has it has actually got me through renders where it would crash before but this one it was just too long or it had that little movement that just sent my CPU miles like into 90 degree territory and it didn't like it. My um, motherboard just shuts the computer off and I was asleep, hence the darkness. <laughs> so yeah, bit of a long intro, but let's get to the solution. So let me move this back to the side and the program we're going to be using is this thing called Untrunk GUI. Um, GUI because it's a visual version it's actually made for Linux and people have been recommended to use a virtual machine and all this and it's really complicated I was gonna try and do it and um, then I got stuck <laughs> installing a virtual machine so I thought uh, is there a Windows build out there looked around had to really look deep and then coincidentally found it here on this ants wlock version um, if you scroll down there is gui the gui is optional it is included in the automated windows build so if you do Control f and search for windows builds it should come up on this page then you go latest and then choose 32 or 64 x32 or x64 depending on your um, operating system if you've got 32-bit which is rare now nowadays in 2021 um, still use this one uh, it'll work on 64 bits that's how it how it works um, but 64 bit won't work on 32 bit I'm pretty sure so get 64 if you're on a 64 bit PC because it'll use a bit more memory I think I think that's all that there is behind it but you know either way you can use a 32 that's probably the safest um, but I use the 64 so what you do is you load the program up um, you know ex extract the files load untrunk GUI and then you'll have your broken file like this so you know if you run it in VLC it won't play it won't do anything it's just like a bulk file and you're like what can I do with this but I managed to fix it and here it is here you can see here's where it broke Ghost helicopter, the hell? So there, my 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 recording glitch, my PC overheated, and that was the end of that. So you um, need reference files, so another file you recorded on that same device or in the same kind of configuration. So same bit rate, same, you know, same camera, same settings, everything. It doesn't need to be the same duration though. Um, and you put that as a reference file. And then the truncated file is going to be the broken file. They call it truncated, and untrunk is meant to, you know, add that move atom. Um, so you press repair, it'll do its stuff, and then it should fix it. 
it may be the stuff at the very end of the clip is like you know too far gone you know the power cut and it didn't manage to save it or something in time before the you know the thing shut down depending on the speed of the sd card hard drive etc um but yeah i hope this helps let me know um so yeah you just put the healthy file like you know one of these episode 712 72 8182 which i rendered which are fully okay um as the reference I, I tried to put one which was long you know the longest in size pretty much and you know you put the truncated file here and then you press repair and it comes up with one underscore fixed and then yeah this one plays nicely all good oh, it's silent century or you know ron Ottoman, I think his character is in GTA RP. Anyway, um, yeah, hope this helped. I've seen a few videos out there on YouTube, but I'm not sure if anyone's shown one of a Windows build, so maybe I'm the first guy, I don't know, honestly. But yeah, I'm filming this at 5 a.m. in the morning, hence why I'm whispering. Hopefully, I can uh, be heard though, and yeah, hopefully, this helped. Just a quick video out there. So yeah, it's been Joseph Stolze. I'm out. Peace.